Hey, what's up? Chris here. And today we're going to be learning how to draw a vampire cape. Let's get to it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to start at the very top where the vampire's head would be. And this would be the collar, which is... You see that around the back of the vampire. It looks all sleek and stuff. So this is the collar. And we're going to come down. And this is the shoulder part of the cape. These are the little tassels or strings, what have you, that would tie around the vampire's neck and hold the cape around his neck. We'll bring a line down here. And then we'll bring this line across. Same thing on the other side. We'll just bring a line down and let it flow out. This is the cape. But we have to do a couple of more things to it first. We have to draw these lines here to emphasize the shadowing. So we'll draw some lines, squiggly lines at the bottom, along the bottom of the cape. And down here, we'll draw these lines going straight down. Sometimes capes are multicolored, which you can have like another color is filled in on the inside. So you can always go like this to show that. And like this much of the cape will be filled in. But being how this is a thin pointed marker, we will get a wider one and just use that to show the emphasis of another color inside the cape. So as we finish this up, I present to you, and I'm quite sure this vampire will be upset when he finds out it's missing. I'm Chris, and this is how you draw a vampire's cape. Mm -hmm.